Sasha opens the door to spoiler, which is just the first surprise, and Sam tells Dent she can save Lulu. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. In Terry's office, Sam reels upon learning she's a match for Lulu. If only she'd been tested sooner. Terry assures her the fact that she's here now is amazing. Now, she needs to decide if she'll go through with the secondary screening to determine if she can donate. Sam readily agrees to it, but doesn't want to tell Dante until she's sure the transplant is a go. After Lulu is stabilized at the hospital, Portia needs a word with Liz and Isaiah. Liz tells an anxious Dante to wait in Lulu's room and that she'll update him later. In the corridor, Isaiah explains that while he was checking on Lulu, he saw that her ventilator was powered down. Elizabeth adds she assisted him until the ventilator was replaced. Portia thanks the doctor for his quick work, but reminds him he's not on staff there. Liz says if it weren't for him, Lulu might not have made it. Jordan joins them, surprised to hear Isaiah saved Lulu's life. Isaiah explains her ventilator failed. Maybe, Portia says. They still have to investigate because closely monitored ventilators don't fail for no reason. After Liz and Portia step away, Isaiah asks Jordan to dinner to repay her for saving his life. They banter over her being a debt to be repaid before they head off together. Elsewhere in the hospital, Portia and Elizabeth agree they've never seen a ventilator just break down like that. Portia plans to call the vendor, worried about a lawsuit. Elizabeth doesn't know how much longer Lulu can hang on. If Sam's liver isn't viable, Lulu could die. After summoning Jason to Anna's office, Brennan arrives. He informs them they sent a team to Sidwell's compound after the drone strike, but his body wasn't among the casualties. Plus, the pilot he hired to get them out of Africa has been murdered. His plane was ransacked and torn apart leading him to ask if either of them brought back a souvenir from their travels. They assure him they had no time to pick up knickknacks. He asks about Lucky and Holly. They rule out Lucky but can't vouch for Holly's every movement. He recommends they keep their eyes open because Sidwell will take down anyone who gets in his way. Felicia meets Holly at the bistro as the latter admires Sasha and Cody's Deception magazine ad. Felicia fills her in on Cody being Mac's son, and that Sasha is his girlfriend. Polly's brows raise as she anxiously asks more questions about Cody, specifically if he's pulling a con on Mac. Felicia is confident he's a Scorpio. Hurrah, Holly says, wincing. You can never have too many of them. She nervously sips her drink. Diane leaves Robert's office when Mac arrives. Mac is thrilled to see them so happy and warns his brother away from Holly. Robert assures him he's in a relationship he really wants. Mac is happy to hear he's moved on, but he doesn't trust Holly. He urges Robert not to let her blow up his relationship with Diane. At the Quartermain mansion, Sasha tells Michael that Cody needs an investor for Serenity. If the money were for her, Michael would be all in, but he doesn't know Cody that well. Therefore, it's not a wise use of his funds. He assures her this won't affect their friendship and leaves. Tracy enters the living room to confront Sasha about asking Michael for money. Sasha explains why she did it for Cody. Tracy wants Sasha to remember her place. Asking Michael, her employer, for money is egregious. If anything like this happens again, Sasha will be seeking employment elsewhere. At the nurse's hub, Dante yells at Elizabeth for not returning to update him. She explains she had to follow procedures and fill out an incident report first. Dante hangs his head and apologizes. Liz knows he's just worried and that he loves Lulu. They laugh over falling for the Spencer siblings. Elizabeth notes they both moved on, though and found happiness with other people. Doesn't mean we love them any less, Dante says. Elizabeth gets a message from Terry that the screening tests aren't in. Jordan and Isaiah have a drink at the surf lodge. 
They flirtatiously banter as they discuss their professional callings. Isaiah says being a transplant surgeon was amazing, but he's not in the miracle business anymore. Diane returns to Robert's office and asks what Mac wanted. He admits Mac is convinced he's still hung up on Holly, but assures her he isn't. She playfully asks for more convincing, so he kisses her. As Sasha collects herself over her encounter with Tracy, she answers a knock at the Quartermain's door. Holly stands on the other side. What are you doing here, mother? A stunned Sasha asks. Sam tearfully comes to Dante in Lulu's room. It's me. I'm the match. I can save Lulu. 